As the Spurs taking it the other way, they come in fresh off a win against the Heat. And bottom line, they found ways to score. Credit the game plan going in. It was right on the money. They knew that the arena would be rocking. And if they could execute well on the offensive end, they knew they could quiet down this hostile crowd. And the call on the shot that sends him to the line. A ton of moves in Kevin's arsenal makes the defender into the foul. The Cavaliers have had two chances at the line already, making a both. Yeah, really, they haven't been able to differentiate themselves from the free throw line on the season at about 76%. Free throw missing. Well, pro probably a little draft in the arena tonight. He's the last guy you expect to miss the mark by that. Absolutely. Much. I can't believe he missed those shots. Wow, he is usually lights out from there. A free flowing yeah. first quarter. Great scoring through one. It's the Spurs leading by four. Live from the AT&T Center in San Antonio. You're watching 2K Sports. Just joining us, we've played through one quarter of action so far. What do you guys think so far about the offensive approach for the Spurs? Establishing a paint presence early in the game, it really helps and pays big dividends down the line because it frees up your perimeter. And it seems they've also put an emphasis on moving the ball, working to rotate around the defense and find those quality looks. They've got Richardson. He's out there with Jones. And it's Jang in at the five, roaming the paint. So that's who San Antonio starts the second with. Now here's Allen. That's in, and that's his fourth basket of the night. He's taken seven shots, a solid 57%. Teams nowadays tracking deflections in addition to steal. Were they something you were aware of when you played defense? Yeah, even if they weren't tracked, uh, they were valued. And, and I remember early in my career, that was something with the Knicks that we would always emphasize because deflections were a true indicator of activity, especially defensively. The Spurs making a switch here. Johnson's checked in. Off the inbound. And the slam dunk by Johnson. So aggressive and explosive. Keldon Johnson excels at getting to the rim and finishing strong. Good on the shot. Jared Allen's got four points in the quarter. And really, it's been a major aspect of their offense in the early stages here. Their success working the ball inside and getting points from close range. And a great job to get that angle on a tremendous drop. And the awareness of his footwork and body on that drive. Wow. Here's Jones. Jared Allen making his last shot. Just five on the clock. The Spurs need to get a shot off here. Johnson for three. They get it again. And so Levert will bring it up for the Cavaliers. Count the basket. Darius a solid passer at his position. Levert excels at finding his teammates when they're open. Right now, I'd send it over to the sidelines and get a report from David Aldridge. Thanks very much. Now, for 22 straight years, San Antonio made the playoffs. They haven't made the last three postseasons. And former Spur Robert Ory worries if they'll ever be relevant again, saying, I hate to say that. San Antonio is a small market. Guys just aren't going to go there. And that's a dire prediction for such a story a successful franchise. No kidding, David. All right, thank you. Clean pass by Keldon Johnson to set up the shooter beautifully. What a play. Timeout called Cleveland. Well, it's a player's lead, but certainly coaching has its place. Yeah, if that weren't the case, you wouldn't see so many coaching changes in the offseason.
The Cavaliers trail by four. To the paint. Here's Allen. That's good. And it's Levert with the assist. Allen's got 12 in the game. And Allen's a competitor. He knows what his job is, and he has to be a major presence inside. He has to have the ability to score points down low. Two points. That one goes. Relentless on the offensive glass, and then you love to finish. And that one's good. Osman. That's a nice read. The value of keeping your eyes up. The Spurs have gone 4 of 7 from the field in this second quarter so far. Back to Jones. Nice ball movement by San Antonio. That one falls. And it's eight points for Jakob Pertl. Even against contact, Jakob Pertl stays strong. A guy his size won't get tripped up very easily. Inside. And that one's good. Osman. Fantastic ball movement. They're picking them apart with their passing. Jones, the pass to Richardson. And here's McDermott. Here's Pirtle, defended by Allen. Pirtle kicks to Richardson. Baseline jumper. Tries again. It's good. Johnson's got his third basket of the night. Positioning and timing pays off big for Keldon Johnson with some second chance points. Timeout called Cleveland. You know, Steve, the persistent growth of Keldon Johnson is pretty impressive. It is, Kevin. He is obviously receptive to good coaching and is committed to finding success here in the league. Almost across the board, you see his stats creeping up season to season. Cavaliers trail by four. Allen passes to Levert. And here's Love for three. And it's Allen with the jam. And that's what happens when you get after it on the glass. Allen grinding it out and creating that second chance opportunity for himself. Hooked away. Hollis with it. Now defended by McDermott. And there's Garland. That's good on the assist by Love. Garland's got the game tied up here for the Cavs. The Spurs have gone 6 of 10 from the floor here in the second quarter. Jones dishes to McDermott. And Darius Garland picks up the foul. That's his first foul. The Spurs making a switch here. Collins is checked in. Davis is checked in for Cleveland. Ricky Rubio comes in for Karis LeVert. Here's Primo, covered by Rubio. And there it is for him. Roby's got six. Pushing the action, getting others involved. He does it time and time again. You know what it is? Terrence it's his creativity. Davis. That's making this engine run. For San Antonio, they've gone 7 of 11 from the field in the second quarter. Tipped away. Rubio looking around. Outside, Davis launches a three. Rebounded by McDermott. And Get that one to go. Jenny Out of contact, Oscar. and he'll go to the line First for two. Foul. Foul. Third team foul. Two. The Spurs have hit all four of their chances so far in this one. Josh Primo at the line for two.
and he makes the first. Gator Bates Diops checked in for McDermott. I'll well, switch here also for Cleveland. That is checked in. Good on both. 135 left now here in the second. Love outside. Over Collins. Love, no luck. High percentage look for him. But bottom line, they're not all going to go down. Jones. Good D by Rubio. That's not the type of opportunity he fails to convert very often. The shot from the low post is good. Love's got his first Gary points in this one. That's their third straight make off an assist. Pass to Bates Dia. Collins, good. And the Spurs lead by two. Great timing. That can be the difference between an assist Cavaliers. and a turnover. And the Cavaliers call time here. And one thing to like about Bates Diop is his ability to score from all three areas. Greg, what I like is he's comfortable facing up. And he can put the ball on the floor. He's a strong cutter, and that kind of versatility goes a long way in the NBA. Stevens has checked in. 59 seconds left in the first half of the game. Davis finds Rubio. Here's Love. That's in. Coming off an assist from Rubio. Rubio's got three assists tonight. Spurs have gone 8 of 13 in the second quarter. Well above the 50% mark from the field. The pass debates Dion. There's 39 seconds left to play here in the second quarter. For three, it's hauled in by the Cavaliers. Here's Davis, and he drops in the layup off the glass. Davis has got four this quarter. Unselfish, moving the ball. Love to see this kind of offense. Here's Primo, covered by Rubio. Here's Primo. He had 15 points last out. Shot clock at three. Jones, no one around him. Off target with his three. And out of bounds as the Spurs gain possession. Substitution on the court. Jared Allen has been on display for the Cleveland Cavaliers. He notched eight points in the quarter and has that terrific basketball instinct on display. And we'll be right back after this. And now, the 2K Sports Halftime Show. Hey, everybody. Tremendous first half. Glad to have you back. Ernie Johnson, Shaquille O'Neal, Kenny the Jensen. Jared Allen having an outstanding game. He had 14 points, four rebounds, and one assist. This has been a bounce-back game for him after some struggles their last time out. Kenny, what's your take on Cleveland so far? They're running a smooth offense tonight, creating high-quality shots. Motion, sharp. Sharp as a goal. Their spacing is excellent. They're moving the ball well. I love the way they do that. Shaq, what did you see from San Antonio? Hard to feel happy when your opponent shoots the whole season. You're going to have to make things harder for those guys defensively. Force them out of their comfort zone. Contest every shot. Thanks for joining us, folks. We're now just a few minutes away from the start of the third quarter. <laughs> 